Rambling Man here. Okay, I got a question for you. All right, so did anybody see uh, President Biden go on, you know, and, and talk about uh, that you have to take a job. If you're unemployed, you have to take a job if it's reasonable. All right, so here's my question on that. What do they deem reasonable? Because here's what I'll tell you. If you're paying somebody, let's say $500 a week for unemployment, and that, that got extended, right, because of all their craziness they put through there. Then they're paying an extra $300. That's $800 a week. So in order for it to be reasonable, in my mind, you'd have to make more than $3,200 a month. Or $800 a week, which is $20 an hour. Now, let's, let's be honest. If these people weren't making $20 an hour before, why would you want to go back to work? If somebody's going to pay you more money than that. And what do they deem reasonable? Because if I... Say I was... Let's just put this in perspective. Say I was making uh, $6,000 a month. Well, even $3,200 is not a lot. That's a little more than half of what I was making, right? Well, then it, say I'm, I'm making $2,000 a month. Well, $3,200, that's $1,200 more than I was making a month. So... Is this reasonable amount of a salary that they're offering across the board? Does that mean I and another person that makes a lot less on a regular monthly basis have to take that same job that they offered? Is that the reasonable job they're talking about? These are legitimate questions. I'm just wondering, what does he mean by reasonable job offers? Here's the thing. Why do you think we're in this situation? And look, I've been on unemployment before, and that's not a lot of money. But when you're going to turn around and throw somebody $300 more a week just to stay at home, and you're not making a lot of money already, why would you want to go back to work? So someone that caused the problem is now going to try to help the problem. Well, not really help the problem, but try to get out of this problem that he's already in because he caused it. Does that make sense? Please tell me I'm wrong. I don't think I am. But that's just my thoughts on the whole matter of this unemployment debacle we're in. Who wants to go to work when you don't have to? And what is a reasonable job offer? Let me know. Random Man, out.